Seboric keratosis is also termed as Veruca seborica. It is common in middle-aged or older individuals and it is rare below the age of 30. The usual site that is involved is trunk, extremities, head and neck. Uh, there is an entity that is termed as Dermatosis papillosa nigra. It is present in 35% of African American adults and uh, also in Southeast Asian uh, people and uh, this is presence of multiple small seboric keratosis on the face. The pathogenesis of seboric keratosis, the sporadic cases are associated with activating mutation in the fibroblast growth factor receptor 3. While this uh, seboric keratosis is also indicator of uh, visceral malignancy such as gastrointestinal malignancy in these uh, this is termed as lesser trailer sign in case of gi malignancies the tumor cell are responsible for transforming growth factor alpha secretion and uh, this is responsible for stimulation of the keratinocytes and this stimulated keratinocyte then result in seboric keratosis. Morphologically, the lesion of seboric keratosis has uh, variable shapes. It may be round, flat, wine like waxy plaque or pedunculated in appearance. The size ranges from millimeters to several centimeters. Usually, it is 0.5 to 3 centimeter in diameter. The color is variable. Uh, it is light brown, brown or deeply brown and uh, it is uniformly tan to dark brown in color. The surface is velvety and granular and uh, on dermoscopy there is presence of a small round pore like ostia that are impacted with keratin. This picture is showing the gross appearance of uh, uh, lesion of seboric keratosis. This is a well demarcated coin like pigmented lesion and uh, there are <coughs> dark keratin uh, filled surface plugs are also there. The lesion of seboric keratosis has got well-defined edge and uh, it is it has got warty papillary surface often with keratin plug and uh, the lesion is raised above the surrounding skin that gives uh, a stuck on appearance to this lesion. This is another picture, uh, gross appearance of the lesion of seboric keratosis. Uh, it is a large, there, is, there are many large lesions and they are imparting a, a stuck on appearance of the lesion. When the lesion are small, they have got a smooth surface and should be differentiated from basal cell carcinoma and nodular melanoma. Dermatosis papillosa nigra is uh, common in black African, African American and deeply pigmented Southeast Asians and uh, these are characterized by multiple small pigmented papules seen on face of adults with black skin and uh, these uh, lesions have uh, got a strong familial tendency and histologically these are similar to seboric keratosis. On histology there is an exophytic and sharply demarcated growth from the adjacent epidermis and the cells are composed of sheets of a small cell that resembles basal cells of the normal epidermis uh, as is seen in this picture. There is presence of melanin uh, if uh, melanin is there, they impart a brown color to the lesion or melanin can be present in variable quantity. There is presence of hyperkeratosis, horn cyst or pseudo horn cyst. The 
pseudo hornsest uh, are have got the communication with the exterior and hornsest are buried inside uh, if the lesion is inflamed the cells show whirling foci of squamous differentiation so this is another picture of the seborrheic keratosis this is sharply defined brown lesion that is imparting a stuck on appearance histologically there is presence of mature and after zinc stratified squamous epithelium and uh, there is uh, presence of numerous horn cysts there is hyperkeratosis also